Hi, I'm Brittany with Condi Systems, and today I'm going to show you how to make a vapor micro performance tea. First, the items you'll need today are a blank tea, the image you'd like to display, a pair of scissors to cut out your image, a sticky lint roller, some Condi Dye Trans Pro Spray, and then I have here two options. I have foam that I've cut out of a vapor foam kit, or you can use a Teflon pillow. I'm going to be using the foam today. And lastly, I have a couple sheets of protective paper. What I'll want to do first is insert my foam inside my t-shirt and get ready for a pre-press. I'm going to line my vapor foam just underneath the seam of my collar so that when I press, I don't have any extra lines from the heat of my press. Let me smooth out my wrinkles. Once I have my foam right where I like it, I'm going to run the sticky lint roller over my t-shirt. Make sure there's nothing that's going to distort my image. Once I finish with my sticky lint roll, I'm ready to pre-press. Doing a pre-press is going to get rid of any excess moisture and it's going to make a nice clear image. First, I want to place a sheet of protective paper on the bottom of my press. Next, I'll place my t-shirt with my foam. And last, I have another sheet of protective paper. We're using light pressure today. We're going to pre-press for 10 seconds at 385 degrees. Once I finish with my pre-press, I can lift and swing away on my press, remove my top sheet of protective paper, grab my t-shirt, which is nice and flat now. While it's still warm, I'm going to sticky lint roll one more time just to be extra thorough. And that should be perfect. Now I'm ready to start applying my image. You don't necessarily have to cut out your image. I find it's easier to align your image with your t-shirt when it's a lot smaller and not on such a large page. So that's why I'm going to use my scissors to cut out my image. Once I have my image cut out, I'm going to lightly mist it with Condi Dye Trans Pro Spray, which you may want to do over a trash can because it can ruin your floor surface. I'm just going to hold this out and lightly mist. Flip over my transfer, place it on my t-shirt. You can realign if you have to using your Condi Dye Trans Pro Spray. It does let you maneuver your picture a little bit. But other than that, we'll just make sure that we have no wrinkles and we'll be able to press our image. Now I'm ready to press. Place this sheet of protective paper on the bottom of my press. Grab my t-shirt with my image. Place another sheet of protective paper on the top. And we're going to press using light pressure for 50 seconds at 385 degrees. That sound means we're done, so I'm going to lift and swing away on my press. Remove my top sheet of protective paper. I'll peel back on my transfer. That turned out really well. I'm just going to leave it here for just a couple seconds, let it cool, and my t-shirt will be complete. Now that my t-shirt is cooled, my project is complete. I'm Brittany with Systems, and thank you for joining us.